Good morning everyone this is another session on palmistry and in this video we will be discussing about the offshoots right now this is the lifeline and when we get small offshoots from these lines and these are the extra effort we put put at different uh, times in our life so time them right so with the help of lifeline we can time such events and time at what age you know you put an extra effort based on the length of the line the darkness of the line if the darkness and the length is more the more effort is put right also you know these 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 are also an indication of wealth sometimes because you know because they also indicate towards achievements and if these lines are long and well colored well dark it also indicates that the person accomplished it can be a success in career it can be you know, getting wealth so yeah these kind of offshoots going up in direction from the lifeline can also indicate towards wealth at times right apart from that see we talked a lot about the fate line the fate line marks its way to the mount of saturn and it starts from center or moon or sometimes here always remember see if a line is very very light or very faint right uh, it, it it's becoming very faint or if in general it is like very very light then that can mean that the person's uh, career life can be a bit troublesome light fate lines are never considered good and in my personal experience also i have seen a lot of people with very light fate lines and they always face sudden troubles something or the other luck not working their way right definitely i would say light fate lines are worse than no fate line because if there is no fate line the person is more self made does not believe in luck at all and the person who is having a light fate line will be unlucky rather right so light fate lines are definitely not fortunate so these people should always be careful with regard to their fortune also remember that you know if there is some islanding on the fate line say there is a island on the fate line or somewhere else there is island or some defect okay some defects on the fate line it does not only mean you know it does mean that it was some of your uh, career problems or some other career uh, up upset but not mainly because of you see even see this timing would come to be around say 25 it is possible that at 25 other the person's career got ruined it can also mean that the person's big uh, or their uh, or the person's parent became bankrupt so the money was less so the person could not pursue his career. so the fate line indicates about your career but it also includes the influences of others also like your parents because financially they were supporting you at that age so even if they are bankrupt or they have some troubles then that also will be indicated in the fate line so fate line does indicate if it is light or having some defects it does indicate towards defect in your career but the the source can be someone else also right there can be there can be a blockage in your career because your parents don't allow you to do so right so that also is indicated by horizontal bars or circles or some other defect on the fate line so the influence of others blocking your career will also be indicated on the fate line right hopefully you got few more points regarding the fate line and the offshoots found on the lifeline and also remember a light fate line is not considered good even a chained fate line or a curvy fate line is not considered good right i'm shudang into palmistry do check my channel for more thank you take care bye bye